Welcome to 5 Minute Fantasy Booking. This is the series where I take a WWE or AEW wrestler and fantasy book them from the point they're at now in hopefully 5 minutes or less. In this episode, I've decided to fantasy book CM Punk's AEW Championship win. So this will start at All Out this year. CM Punk will defeat Darby Allin at All Out after a 20 minute match. The next night, Punk is in, the ring talking about who should be his next opponent. Just then, MJF and Wardlow come out and MJF says, so I talked with Tony and he told me that I have to team with you of all people. So, later that night, Punk, MJF, and Wardlow face the elite. However, before the bell rings, MJF and Wardlow beat down CM Punk and the match is called off. Kenny Omega helps CM Punk back to his feet before holding up the two sweets sign. Punk two sweets Omega, thus joining the elite. Over the next few weeks, CM Punk picks up victories over the likes of Joey Janela, Orange Cassidy, etc. This leads to him getting a TNT Championship match against Miro at Full Gear. At Full Gear, Punk beats Miro with the help of the elite to win the TNT Championship. He successfully defends the title for months leading, up to AW Revolution where he faces Andre Del Idolo. These two put on an amazing 25-minute match. Towards the end of the match, Kenny Omega throws a chair in the ring, which CM Punk wedges it in the corner. Punk goes to throw Andre into the chair, but Andre counters and throws Punk into it. Andre turns Punk around and hits the hammerlock DDT pins CM Punk and wins the championship. There, Elite get in the ring and help Punk up to his feet. All of a sudden, Kenny Omega hits a V-trigger on Punk and they start beating him down before leaving the ring. The next night, Kenny and the Young Bucks are in the ring explaining their actions, when CM Punk's music hits and he runs towards the ring as the Elite escape through the crowd. Punk grabs a microphone and says, Kenny, what you and there. Bucks did last night was a huge mistake, no one does that to me and gets away with it that easy. So keep avoiding me while you can, because at double or nothing, I'm going to take the AEW championship and prove that I'm the best in the world. For the months leading up to double or nothing, Omega and Punk take shots at each other and pick up wins over various members of the roster. At double or nothing, Punk and Omega have a great match. But the match ends when the Elite try to get involved but it fails and leads to Punk hitting a GTS and winning the championship. So, that is how I would book CM Punk's AEW championship win. Make sure to leave suggestions in the comments of who I should do next. Thanks for watching.